All right, guys, it's time for some live duels with Evil Swarm. Should be pretty simple. We're either going to be swooping monsters or just stopping monsters from coming out at all. It's going to be really straightforward. It's going to be floodgates. It's not going to be one of those duels where you're going to be trying to make a lot of decisions. I'm sure there will be a point, but it's mostly going to be sitting some floodgates. So I hope you guys enjoy, and thanks for watching. All right, here we are facing an Odeon. He's not one to get beat by a... Uh, Floodgate per se, so uh, let's let's see what we can do. Okay, we'll use the Mad Dregora here. Save uh, the other dude in case we need that extra normal summon or something like that. And we'll try to go as quick as possible. Now, it's gonna be an obnoxious duel if he's an Odeon player and it's a bunch of traps. So we'll have to see how that goes, but uh, we'll see from here. We'll get plenty of. Pandemics doesn't matter that he sees where we set it because the other one's a pandemic too. So we're all good. there. We go. Now we'll see if he sets a bunch of back row or if he's just. I honestly can't even imagine what else an Odeon would be. He'd have to be like uh, uh, ch 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 what is it? Egyptian gods. He's not Egyptian gods, though. So we we gotta just hope we can uh, we can win this duel. I'm even gonna keep the floodgate. Should we keep the floodgate alive? I'm gonna keep the floodgate alive because I'm assuming he has. Uh, we're gonna keep the floodgate alive because I'm assuming he has trap monsters. You know what I mean? Trap monster monsters? Yeah, that's nothing. He would have to chain another card. That's not going to do anything. Okay, and then we can't use his effect. Should we hit the floodgate? I think we're going to hit the floodgate. Because if I hit the floodgate, we're going to be able to bring out the Mandragora. Okay. Floodgate gone. But now we have another... Pandemic, okay. And we can use this effect. That's gonna give us another normal summon, and. Or actually, this is gonna give us two more normal summons? Oh my goodness, this is gonna give us two more normal summons. He's gonna have a real tough time fighting us. Let's see. How should we handle that back row, though? What extra deck monster? Because we could go Ouroboros. Yeah, let's go Ouroboros, huh? So we're about to bring out our biggest monster. We open the floodgates with the Ouroboros. We have the uh, Pandemic already live, but we have a fresh Pandemic. We have two Pandemics for this Ouroboros. Ouroboros is going to be able to return that back row anyway. Maybe he won't be able to summon the monster he's trying to summon. Um, like that. Try to get one card your opponent controls. Actually, we're going to banish a card first. Man, actually... Because if we do this, he'll have to use the trap, and then he's going to use a Paleozoic monster, and we can't bounce the Paleozoic monster. So I think first I'm going to banish... Oh, yes. Two Paleozoic monsters, though. Oh, he doesn't have a delay, though. Why doesn't he have a delay? Oh, man, wait. Did we mess that up? Yeah, we did. He didn't have a delay. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we messed it up. We're not going to lose the monsters, but he's going to bring out a, uh, a Paleozoic. Oh, man. But we already have all our stuff. Wait, no, he didn't bring out a Paleozoic? Oh my goodness. Wait, yeah, he did. Okay. Wait, no, Kyroid, what? What is going on? What a duel. What a duel. Okay, he used both Kyroids. Now, he's not floodgated, but I mean... What was he gonna do anyway with a level 5 or higher monster? I don't believe it. So we gotta rest all our hopes in this last pandemic. Oh, Lava Golem. Oh my goodness. 
So would Lava Golem be able to get over the Floodgate? Huh. That's a good question. I wonder. What do you guys think? Lava Golem gets over the Floodgate or what? Because you can- you use the Floodgate. The Floodgate has to be up. I don't know, that's a, another dual quiz for another day, but let's see what he's what he's got with that back row, huh? Oh, I was thinking Rainbow Life, but Marilla's not good. You gotta have better than that. You're gonna have to do better than that, my guy. Paleozoics are cool, you know I'd be playing Paleozoics. But, uh... You, you need, uh, you're not gonna get far with that. Not gonna get far with that. Yeah, cause they'll have to, uh, yeah, and, uh, Jar of Greed's not the best card either. Yeah, it'll be another, another Paleozoic. But, uh, he's kind of running out of those quick. And we'll still attack. They're not really a threat to us. They are just... <sighs> stalling. Stalling the inevitable. We still got our one pandemic. Man, you guys remember when Lava Golem used to do a thousand damage every time? Wouldn't that be wild? We'd be 500 lower. What's he got in his hand? No way he's got another kite roid, huh? What do you guys think? Now it's it's nice to have this evil golem because we could get rid of the actually. Mm, let's just hit him for lethal. We get. I think he has a kite roid though. I think he does have a kite roid. I think he might. But then he'll be in pure, absolute top deck mode, if that were the case. I think he does have one more Paleozoic in his graveyard, though, that Marilla. Okay. Now listen, hear me out. The Paleozoic... He, they, can't, they can't kill us. I'm a 1250 can't stop us. One will summon. I'm not even gonna use our I'm not even gonna use our pandemic, guys. Isn't that wild? Cause I just don't I don't see the danger to us yet. He's not gonna burn eighteen hundred more, you know? I don't know. He, he's he's gonna have to just duel his own duel, I guess. We'll see. He's gotta have his other Kiteroid though. What other card wouldn't he be placing? Maybe an Effect Veiler or something, but that wouldn't be, uh... Wouldn't be very good. What is, what is that supposed to be? They're gonna take our guy from our hand, my boy. That's not good. Yeah, he's, uh, he's really in trouble now. He's trying, Rick. He's trying. Because all we'll have to do is get past a Kite Roid the next turn. And any monster is going to be lethal. So it is a Kite Roid. So... The Pandemic's going to stop any card he's going to get. I don't think we even need to top deck another card to beat whatever he's got. To beat the field. You know what I'm saying? Because that's not going to touch us. And is that enough? He's not strong enough. But watch this. Watch this. Okay. Watch this Maddie Laddie play. He's going to win us a duel right here. Or no. He does. Does he have another? Oh. I almost messed that up. Does he have another? Uh. 
no, he's out of Paleozoic, so as soon as we get this monster out, that's GG for our boy. Even over the Kyroid, he has lost the duel. So we're gonna turn Toggle on out of fear and go for the finish here, guys, against a, against a guy who didn't even care about our flood game. Unbelievable. How rude. He just gonna let us finish him? No, he's going to the Kyroid. So he did have another Kyroid. I can't believe it. Two of the Kyroids. But you can't stop us, my guy. We're gonna use our Pandemics. That won't work. Oh, that's all he can do. Sorry, my guy. You knew you'd lost from the beginning. Why would you put the back row hate into your Odeon? You love the back row. Don't hate the back row. Sorry, Kyroid. And that's the duel. Stall it all you want. Still gonna get hit, Odeon. Great, great stuff, guys. Not the kind of duel I expected for the Evil Swans, though. Great stuff. Alright, here we are facing Little Yug on a win streak. We're going second, though, so we're not gonna lock him out super tough, but maybe we will be able to scoop something if we get enough monsters in our hands. We'll need three. And we only have two, so we'll need to draw one. But we only have four spell cards left in our deck, and uh, 12 monsters left in our deck. Oh, Candora! So uh, we should be okay. And we should be able to get a scoop. The odds are in our favor. Okay. We scoop whatever monster he's sitting out and we win the duel. But it doesn't look like he's sitting out any monsters. So we might get to floodgate our boy. After all. I think we will. Man, we had enough to scoop too. But uh, what are you going to do? Oh man, we're, we're actually going to have a lot. We're gonna do pretty well right now. Man, can we scoop his face down monster too? Hold up, wait a minute. Cause we can, uh... I think we gotta send... No, we don't even have to send him. We can just send anything. We can just send Mandragora, cause we're gonna search him. Okay. Yeah, we're doing fine. Boom. We got two pandemics in our hand too. This guy is uh He's in trouble. So now we go with I keep wanting him to say Kekleon, like the Pokemon, but it's Kerkekion. Curry Kekion. Curry Kekion? Curry Kekion? How do you say that name, guys? So now we're gonna banish one, add the Mandragora. Ooh. Thank you, Mandra. Now, does the scoop have to be face up? Yeah, face up. Target face up monster. That sucks. That would have been cool if we could have scooped his uh, his little face down there. Now, I'm, I'm going to bring out Heliotrope because we're going to leave the monster. So he, he needs to be as buff as possible. Come on out, Heliotrope. We're going to search our third infestation, but we're only going to set two. And we're going to use one. Okay, so that back row is crazy. He has a delay right now, so it can't be that crazy. We're going to floodgate him because Gandora, last time I checked, is level 5 or higher. So we should be able to lock him out. He might be able to do something fishy with, like, the skill to get it out or something, but uh, that remains to be seen. We're going to add another infestation. And we should, we should be in a good place. And we're only gonna set two. Cause we gotta worry about this back row. And we don't need to hit him for the big damage. We'll hit him for the little damage. I hope that's not a flip monster. Oh, it's a gadget monster. Okay. He probably would have been better off just normal summoning it. Show me that trap. Show me the trap. Oh, you didn't even use the trap. What the heck? You didn't use the trap, guys. You're supposed to use the trap. Now we have this uh, infestation in our hand for no reason. He's got that determination of flight once again. Man, he could XZ us too. Because gadgets can hop around. I don't know how into the... I mean, he's got a lot of cards in his deck. So if he got 
if he has a silver or gold, he can get some XZs out. We need our XZs import, guys. Why do we never have that? Oh no! He's trying to forbidden chalice us! None of that. We need you to be locked out, my guy. So you could see the floodgates obviously getting to him. But it's not going to be a spell card to save you. Not this duel. Not this turn. And there's the scoop, guys. Floodgates in Duel Links. Can't believe it. Great, great stuff. Alright, here we are facing Nana Kaboom. We just want to go first, and we are going first. Now we just got to see a bunch of monsters. We have 14 monsters, 6 spell cards. We better not see more than 2 spell cards. Still saw 2 spell cards. How annoying is that? Really trying to uh, brick us as hard as it can. We have so few spell cards. We're still looking at hands like this every duel. It makes me sick, guys. It really does. But, despite Konami's hate, we're still going to win this duel right here, right now. We're even going to search a second pandemic. We're going to be good to go, guys. Two pandemics and a XC's import. He's, he's, uh, it's not looking good. This will be a rough duel for him. Because Anna likes to summon the big boys. And a little boy she does summon, like a Pegasus or something, we're just going to steal it. So... This should be a rough duel for him. No level 5 or higher monsters. We are unaffected by spell cards. Even if you have two quick plays, we're going to beat it out. You got a little monster does something crazy, we're going to steal it with XC's import. It's going to be crazy, guys. We're really going to pop off. And if we do gain a monster from XC's import, we're going to be able to get another pandemic. So it's like just absolutely crazy out there. Out of here with this three back row. How obnoxious. Very annoying. Quite annoying. Yeah, this is fine. Or no, I should have gone with Krakion. We could have got two monsters out. Whoops. Because we could have gone with Krakion through the skill. And that would have been... Uh, who should we should go first. We should go first. That would have been uh, a monster banished, a monster to our hand, and then we could have normal summoned it again. Oh my goodness, he shadows. Of course, we should have known. How obnoxious. But he's gonna have a tough time now. In pure top deck mode. And talk about getting the dragon first thing to stop the floodgate. How obnoxious is that? Oh, it returned the floodgate though, so we're gonna bring him right back. See what I mean? <sighs> but we have a decision to make, because we can... If I use the skill, we get Krakion out. He's going to banish one add it to our hand, then we're also going to be able to normal summon it. So I'm going to try that. Should work out. Should be a lethal amount of damage. And should be our third pandemic. So let's see. Oh, this is sent to the graveyard. Ooh. Now this is to our hand. So let's see how this works. Okay. You with me so far? Trying to hit us with the Book of Moon. We're going to turn the toggle on out of raw fear, guys. Out of pure fear. Because he does have more. He can't have all three, though. Okay. Can't have all three. Oh, we beat the one. System works. And now we're going to have all three pandemics, okay? Check this out. So we're going to banish the big boy. Grab this boy. What does he got now? We're unaffected. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get. Get on out of here. Now we're going to be able to normal summon again. Okay. Boom. Normal summon again. Dang, we could normal summon again if we wanted to. 
we had a monster that could search a monster. I don't think we do. We're just gonna floodgate him out again. We know he's shadows. We're not gonna let him get anything crazy out. We'll keep the uh, keep the boy out here. We'll even search. We'll even search our last infestation and really just call it a duel. Because none of these boys are protected. So now we gotta use this other infestation. But if he has a second, we're in trouble. He doesn't have a second. Oh man, he's in trouble. Yeah, we don't even need to search this other infestation. That's, that's, uh, that's it, guys. Shadows have lost. Yeah, because we're already unaffected. We can set this. Nothing to worry about. The duel is over. Fl battle of the floodgates, and we, we out, out flooded them, guys. Shadow floodgate versus evil swarm floodgates, and, uh, we took it to them. Book of Moon, compulsory. It's not gonna help you guys. So, uh, Floodgates, 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 which means link monsters are gonna be crazy, stuff like that. It's it's wild out there, guys. Be careful of these floodgates. Hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching.